everyone, it's Angel here and I've got a washi tape um, stash to show you guys. Hope everyone is doing well. If you're new here, I would like to say a warm welcome to you all. If you like diamond painting content, then hopefully you would like this video and subscribe. And if you're back, <laughs> welcome back. So yeah, today's video is my washi tape stash and these are all the washi tapes I've got. I've actually um, de-stashed a lot and brought more because <laughs> your tastes vary. Now I've only got selected washi tape. So basically Diamond Art Club and um, small shops like on Etsy. I've got rid of all my Amazon ones and, you know, just just like to support small shops with their washi tapes because some of them, they design them and print them. So, furthermore, I will get stuck in. First of all, I'm going to go through my Diamond Art Club washi tape. You know, the free washi tape that we all get with the tool kit. But unfortunately now, we can't get them anymore because of the new packaging. Uh, they have got rid of our washi tapes and cover minders. But I've got a collection here. So these are all from Diamond Art Club. It's so pretty. And there's some that have got the same. So yeah, that's fun. At least I don't have to take these out individually. So we've got them. And then I have some more here. With some different ones. In the mix yeah so let's have a look I, I can tell which ones um, are diamond art clubs so from here is diamond art club and then these galaxy ones and some fruit and cactus some birds oh and that's a diamond art club so these here I've kept from some packs on um, uh, yeah you can tell the difference because you should get like more uh, from uh, Amazon God I can't get my my brain won't function today so yeah so there's a little mix and match I think so this, this one's full, so I should have done that last, which is this one. So I've kept some of the Amazon ones, actually. I thought I got rid of them all, but I haven't. I thought that was a nail then, but it wasn't. Okay, so this is um, all Amazons, I think. Yeah. So some really pretty ones I wanted to keep keep myself and they had a decent amount some don't and some like stick and some don't I've got some lovely anime ones and some cats and I lo I'm loving the gold um gold uh washi tape so anything with the gold I've got to have uh so yeah I'm sure that's a diamond art club one <laughs> So this one's a little bit of a mix and match. So yeah, that is, shouldn't be in there because that's brand new, isn't it? That is sealed. Usually when they're sealed, it's usually a small shop. I'll leave it in there. Yeah, so I'm just, there's, that's a Diamond Art Club, I know that. These are mix and match as well, but I've kept some of the um, Amazons because of the file and how much I get makes a difference because I want to make sure I've got enough for the border and a little bit of sectioning. So that's some of the washi tape. 
but I did get rid of a lot and gave them away. These are Halloween and Christmas ones. Some are from um, Etsy shops out there. So let's have a look. Yeah. I've got this big one. I don't know what I'm going to do with this one. It is massive. But I love it. I love it. I don't know. I'm going to bring that down a bit. I don't know if you guys can see the pumpkins. And I've got this. I think I've got this from Amazon. I'm not sure. This one is definitely a uh, Etsy small shop. I do recommend these. She's lovely. Loves I love her stationery. Season greetings. So this is like a Halloween Christmas theme. Look at the cute little bats. And some pumpkins. Ghosts. That's how much washi tape I love. You can see the difference. So, for example, a Diamond Art Club one and an Amazon compared to a small shop. I love that. And then we've got little ghosts. I think I need to stock up on the Halloween ones, but I've got quite a few that match Halloween. And um, every day, like gothic um, paintings. For example, this is this lovely tower here. So I've got my moons and stars, butterflies, schools, and animals of falling wood. These are all from Et uh, Etsy shops that people have printed for their own. And just and the mount. You get a good amount of washi, you know, and they they print them. You can tell that these are all from small shops. If you're wondering where I got this tower from, I got it from Gretel Creates, so it's pretty cool. I put this one usually by my pens. Because I like to show off a, a few of them. So this is the Christmassy one. I've got quite a few. I've got some little bauble, bauble dots. So that's simple. Some reindeer. Gingerbread man. We love gingerbread man. And the sleigh. Some Christmas trees, happy holidays, very Christmassy, reindeer, and I think this was a set, a set of five, these were a set of five, and then I got, this was a free gift, because I don't usually order these big ones. But yeah, that one um, Gretel creates on Etsy. She did the tower as well. So yeah, I do need to stock up. But most of my Halloween ones, I can mix and match with the Gothic ones. But Halloween is every day for me. Okay, so these I got from a craft shop. I haven't used them. This is my autumn collection. Um, or full, the full collection. I brought these last year. Hopefully we'll use them today. We've got some gnomes and pumpkins. I got this from a craft shop. I'm hoping I will have enough. Here you go. Oh, I like that green. That is really neat. I like that. And we got some little glitter, glitter rose there. Love it. So you get a three meter tape. So yeah, that's really cute. I like that. 
Okay, so these ones are my special ones. So these are all sealed. So I've got them all in order. Again, there is a Halloween one there, but I like to keep it. The ones that are sealed and wrapped, like this is sealed and wrapped. And I can use that for Halloween if I wanted to. Um, I can't remember all the names of the shops, but you've got Gretel Creates. Uh, you've got uh, Ellis Woolley. Wall, Wall, she does all the foxes. She did the uh, animals of Harlingwood. These here as well. She does all these little animals, which would be great for autumn. Got little mushrooms. There you go. All her names are on there. So, bugs. <laughs> um. I've got another gothic one or Halloween one with some schools and foil. Uh, then I've got another brand. And I forgot her name, but these are quite expensive. They're like four pounds. But she... Um, Printed these. These are her own designs. Wow, a cat's bum right there. So that's why I like to support small shops because they do their own prints as well. Not all shops, but most of them on there. But look at this. Look at this. Potions. I don't know if you can see. I don't know if it's focusing or not, my camera's, and I can't move my camera, I don't think it's focusing, oh, there you go, oh my god, look at the potions and the details, so yeah, it's all about the details, and I've got that one, Love this one, it's pink, it's moths. And then we got some fireworks going on, so that could be like a new year painting or bonfire, which is 5th of November, where we have a celebration of fireworks. Ooh. And that is it. So they're pretty good. Ooh. Let's try and put these back. I don't know if I'm going to do it neatly, guys. But... And we got some acorns right there. That can be like a fall. I love my foxes. But if I can show you the detail... There's a cat bum. <laughs> but what I'll do is, in the description, I will list all the washi tape stores that are used. But I just can't remember who's who. You know what I mean? And then on this side, we've got more. Got some purple autumn leaves. We got our bees, we got a lion, ocean. See, I've got a lot of like fall and autumn because it's my favourite season, so I'm alright for the Halloween washi tape. And we got this pretty print one as well. Usually these are expensive, like four or five pounds each but it's well worth it I've got some bats moths uh, is that a koala or an edgehog edgehog <laughs> it's edgehog <laughs> so those are my four containers now for the ones these are brand new 
And these are all from Etsy shops. And these are quite foil ones. I've actually brought another one. So that's pretty neat. I have kind of like downsized. And these are ones that uh, just came as they are without the wrap. So I want to make sure the ones without the wrap don't get damaged, if you know what I mean. So that one belongs on there. Right, these ones I've used on my paintings already so I put them back in here and reuse reuse them because I've got quite a lot left over so I really use um uh, release papers more than sectioning on washi tapes now again this is ones that I've used And if I've got enough, then I know I can reuse them. So, yeah. And that is all my washi um, stash so far. So, obviously, I don't want so much because, yeah, I've got, I've got enough to last me. I might every now and again buy from a new, like a shop on Etsy and just buy a couple. But it does build up. I know it builds up. So, yeah, I hope you enjoyed that. Obviously, I will list all the shops on my description. So feel free to check them out. Give them a like and some, so support them. And uh, hopefully something takes your fancy washi tape's not expensive at all so it's just a little treat to get yourself one or two washi tapes it's something you know even if it's a little order small shops appreciate it if not just give them a like and share it on your socials and yeah that's it i hope you enjoyed the video and uh, I will see you in the next one. Stay safe, stay amazing and happy diamond painting. Bye.